Where is your emergency? Calls came into police after a deadly crash on State Road 44 east of I-4 around 2.30 in the morning Sunday. Okay, like we're stopped and can't go through because there's so much debris in the road. Like Troopers say the driver of a gray Toyota Tacoma was driving the wrong way on State Road 44 in DeLand. The driver hit another car head on. Troopers suspect going about 55 miles per hour and killed three people inside. FHP says the wrong way driver crashed jumped out of the car, leaving a passenger behind, and then ran into the woods. Lisa Tolan manages a bar just down the road and says it's heartbreaking to hear. It's really sad, and I just hate to hear that any of that's happened. It's sad to hear that people are dying and people just don't know how to drive or just don't care. Reckless. Troopers used canines to try to hunt for the wrong way driver, but they couldn't find a scent, so they collected DNA from the crashed abandoned car. The passenger in his vehicle that night was seriously hurt in the crash. They're hoping to get information from that person when they're stable enough to speak. We're, we're going to find out who this person is. They just need to come forward and they need to surrender and say, listen, you know, I, I made a mistake. It's me. I'll, I'll face the consequences because they're going to get caught. And uh, it's better if they turn themselves in and if we come find them. The only survivor in the car that was hit told FHP troopers they believe the runaway driver is a short, heavy set man and say there was a chance he could have saved a life if he just stopped to help. If they had called 911 immediately or if they had rendered aid, somebody might still be alive. And you'll never know that. You'll never get that time back uh, because of that selfish decision you made to leave and flee uh, because you didn't want to, you know, get hemmed up on a. Uh, a license charge or a, a possible DUI charge. In DeLand, Stephanie Wolfmonte, Fox 35 News.